Welcome to Storehouse and Field. Here's a fantastic soup recipe that champions the butternut squash and gives you some ideas on using the seeds and the skin. First of all, let's get all our ingredients together and then start preparing them. Add a tablespoon of oil to a warm pan, followed by the carrots, onion, celery and squash and soften for around about 10 minutes before adding in the garlic and the chilli. Add in the stock and bring everything to the boil. When boiling, turn down to a simmer and allow to simmer for 20 minutes. In the meantime, here's some ideas on using those seeds. The seeds from the butternut squash are edible, so please don't throw them away. Here's a great idea. Just simply give them a wash, pat them dry, pop them into a baking tray with some olive oil, and then bake in the oven for around about 20 to 30 minutes on around 140 degrees. The seeds can then be added to the soup to add texture, or are used on top of salads, or even as just a snack. And let's not waste that skin either. Here's some ideas for using it. Give the skin a good wash in a colander, and pat dry. Next add it to a baking tray. You can add in some herbs, try rosemary or thyme or even sprinkle in some flavouring on like curry powder or smoked paprika. If you've got any leftover bread add that in too, it makes ideal croutons. When the carrots are tender blitz everything down to a nice consistency. If it's too watery pop it back on the heat for a little bit just to thicken up and if it's too thick add a little bit more stock. Serve the soup in warm bowls with some croutons, butternut squash skin crisps and some of the seeds sprinkled on top as well. Absolutely delicious and perfect for these autumn months. So there you have it, a delicious soup using everything from the butternut squash, the seeds, the skin and that tasty flesh.